Man and Mary J. Blige. How dare Kanye talk about the way I dress? I'm dope. Are you crazy? Are you? T- uh, look, uh, look, do you see him? You see him? We had that big ass sweatshirt on and them short, like, with the, like as big as he is talking about the way I dress. Now we know all them voices have room. That's crazy. It, it, it is a thing that I find ironic. He's arguing with me about a woman neither one of us had. Yeah, look, you know, I don't know if as Kanye says that um, God doesn't love me. I've often asked that question myself. But I do know this, that if you have such a connection to God and you're such a conduit to him, that you can summarily uh, have him omit, omit um, great, his grace for me, then that wouldn't be a God that would be a hit man. I don't know if my family, as you say, doesn't love me. I've asked that question before too. But I do know that I can go home without somebody calling the police. You say I'm broke, but I know that you're broken. You say I'm a has been, but I know you never have been happy. This is a, this is an incarnation of the same guy that we see all the time. But you know, and I know that it is the empty wagon that makes all the noise. All of the threats, all of the complaints, all of the the the, the curious things you do. Like you, interestingly, you said well, we'll, we'll probably end up being friends after I, I I can explain your joke. Well, you can explain my jokes. How come you can't explain your behavior? You are acting in a way that I have said and say over again is dangerous. And every day it is teaching young boys and young girls that this is appropriate. Every day we hear a story about some dude that picked up a gun and shot some girl or hurt some girl or did something because they think it's appropriate. It is not. It is not okay. If, if you, if, as you say, we're going to be friends one day, you could never be my friend acting this way. It is inappropriate and it is dangerous and it's scary. And there are people, and if people really love you, all these people who say will kill for you, if they'll twi- peel a cat from you, how come they won't push one down, twist it up, and, oh, and get, get your medication out? They won't do that? You, you, you have managed to grow bigger than mostly any star ever has, and smaller as a man at the same time. All of the, you're fighting, you're fighting Trevor Noah, you're fighting magazines. What you want is something you're not getting back. And if it's the God that you believe in, if that God you serve and always are talking about, maybe this is your trial. Even Jesus was in the wilderness for 40 days. Maybe this, Job had trials, but it's the way you handle it. You get to act stark, raving mad, and your cult pretends like it's okay, and it is not. You can, der- you can deride anybody you want. I tell you this. I tell you this. I'm a man who can say honestly, that I'm the man now that the little boy I was always wanted to be. Can you? Can you say that? All of your money, all of your power, all of your fame, does it satiate you? He don't got a lot of money. Look where he is. The, the truth of the matter is as big as you are, as as small as you're acting. You've decided to make this a spectacle for your own benefit. And there's nothing godlike in that at all. You've decided that you want what you want at all costs, and you rend and you tear to get it. And all the whole time, people enable you by telling you, oh, it's just him. Or it's just. So the truth of the matter is, if, if a woman were acting just like you, they would already be in a conservatorship. Ask Britney Spears. Ask Wendy Williams. People abide you, and it's dangerous. It's setting a dangerous precedent. If you can talk those people into wearing them stupid-ass Yeezys you wear, you can talk them into hurting somebody. You are people, pe- person people look up to, and you've decided to act like this all the while while you are uh, extolling the virtues of God. What God? What, 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 what is that God like about that? You want, oh, you're a pawn for the left. It wasn't me who said that black people, was, was slavery was a choice. I'm a pawn for the left. It wasn't me that said Harry and Tubman didn't free nobody. She just sat on the white, work for the white man. It wasn't me that wore uh, Trump of Donald, uh, hat from Donald Trump, the, one of the most racist, vile people ever. It was you. You have a lot of fans and a lot of people live by that I will not. The, the fact that you would give my uh, my address out to people and I'm getting threats to this day is unconscionable and I do not forgive it. Man to man, I don't fa- I don't fear any man on the face of the earth, especially you. If I had a problem with you, I would never say I'm going to send my goons. It would be me that saw you. You're small and you're acting smaller and you're diminishing whatever legacy you have in front of our very eyes. Look, Kanye, if Jesus can walk... You can too. Of course, it'd be harder with those I Know What You Did Last Summer boots on. That's a little note from the GED section. We've got a jazz report coming up in 15 minutes.